Hey everybody, it's March 21st and I thought it'd be a good time to give you an update and show you what's growing in my garden. Got my string beans here, uh, two different varieties. Climbing up my trellis. Check those beans out. Let's see if we find some. Every day I pick a handful of beans like this. The cool thing about the trellis is it all the beans hang down and it's easy to see. Check out all the beans hanging down up there. I need to pick them. These ones are the Fortex beans. Super prolific. Tons of beans. Check this out, it's today's harvest. I just have about 10 of these Fortex pole bean plants and maybe about five or six of these other string beans, these flat ones like this, and that's it. And every day I get a harvest just like that. It's more than enough for a family. Um, Definitely more than enough for a family of two, but even for a family of four, if you're not preserving these, then it's just right. You're not, you don't really have beans coming out of your ears. <laughs> Got some peas here. Haven't quite started producing peas yet. I picked like maybe three peas, um, but the flowers are coming out, so should be soon. Couple of cucumber plants there on the other side. Trying to get established. This is my Valerie carrots. They should be ready in another 20 days or so. And this is my new Kuroda carrots. They seem pretty tiny. Let's try and pull one out and see what's going on. Oh. Oh, it's doing its thing. Cool. Here I got my uh, Chinese cabbage. Uh, I transplanted these on the 1st of March. Look at how nice they're coming along. This is my Horenzo spinach. Uh, it's coming along. Hey, something ate my broccoli. Man. This bushy thing here is my asparagus patch. And look at this, I see some asparagus here. Here's my strawberries, they're doing really well. Grew them from uh, bare roots. So they're actually two year old plants. I've been picking off the flowers um, so that I could let the plants get a little bigger before they start setting fruit. This is my little finger lime tree right here. It's got little, setting little fruits. Ow, tons of thorns. Look at these little finger limes right here growing. Here's my lettuce in the aquaponics bed. It's almost ready to pick again. 
something ate my lettuce. It was right here. There's supposed to be four of these Merlot lettuces. This is little gem romaine lettuce. This is my manoa lettuce. Doing really well. And that back there is a Okayama. Oh no, sorry. That's a butterhead lettuce. And over here I got some more strawberries. These are different types of lettuces. This one here is the Okayama lettuce. Really tender, tender leaves. And over here is where my seeds start. I got some tomatoes, different tomatoes that I potted on waiting for them to get a little bigger and stronger before they get on in their um, permanent locations. I still have my Maui onions here that I need to put in the ground. Got some other things that I started um, because it was a spring equinox. It's a good time to plant. And some other, these are some old seedlings. I have on reserve and then these this is Chinese broccoli back here there's one more thing I wanted to show you guys um, this is my graft that I did from my friend's tree this is the mandarin oops let me see if I can focus this this is the mandarin orange look at all the leaves this is the graft right here and this is the rootstock right here. This is a, their lemon tree. I think it's kind of like a Myers, improved Myers lemon. Look at all the branches. And then I got another one down here because I was worried that that first lemon graft wouldn't take. So I grafted another lemon here, same tree. Um, and that one took two. So check out those leaves. So on this rootstock here, which I don't know, I just found growing in the yard. So I planted it here, not realizing that citrus um, grown from seed isn't probably, isn't going to be like the parent plant. Um, and so I decided to graft these that I knew were good fruits onto my rootstock. Look at that, my first grafts and they took so excited all right i hope you guys have a great day keep on growing